live at the Redline Fight Night Auckland ABA Stadium on the 11th of November. Fight number six, Shay. I'm joined by current New Zealand champ, Mr. Business himself. I'm absolutely exhausted. We're only up to fight number six tonight. Good night. It's a good night of fights. Um, exciting fights. Every fight we've seen has had a story to go with it. So. Both these boys are cruisers. Looking lean. You know, we're seeing some lean cruisers this time. Ethan in the blue. And Seth in the red. La Mossatelli trained out of Boxing Central. Once again by the Fernando. Ethan looking lean and mean as a cruiser. What a tall cruiser he is as well. Just remember folks, this is the same weight as Robert the Butcher Beerage. This guy looks almost double his height. And a beard to match. These guys are both very tall. They look very wiry. We're going to see a brawl or a clinical matchup tonight, Shay? Uh, we're seeing a bit of we're seeing a fight right now. Both boys look like they can bang. Take a shot at the same time. Ethan, the one coming forward. What an aggressive fighter Ethan is. And well, once again, out of red lines. Oh! oh big he just shot got caught with that centric. big uppercut straight through the middle of the guard. Oh, and he's looking for it again. again. Oh, there it is. Hey, how can you not love that? One, two, left. He's trying one, two, it. He's right going to try it until it fails. Wow, that right uppercut rip is absolutely devastating. But Ethan's not going to take take uh, no for an answer. Look, coming forward, landing a few of his own. I've got to admit, though, that one, two, and that right rip is absolutely beautiful from Cedric. Is it going to land? Is it going to land home and send Ethan to the canvas? From their southpaw stance as well, again. and there it goes again. <laughs> Fernando Orta bred some good fighters out of Boxing Central there. You know, a lot of fighters have signature punches and moves, and that right rip keeps finding home. He's going to land it again, watch. He's going to throw a one-two right. Ethan might walk into it, who knows, we'll see. He did! Oh, big right there comes from back, Ethan! Comes back with his own, punches of his own. I don't know what boys is in the are, water tonight. Boys are dropping bombs tonight. They are certainly dropping bombs. Every punch, every punch has everything behind it. I mean, I'd like to see what's going to happen in the second and third when once the, the gas tank starts running on empty. And again, they're Big right, shots there from they're right uppercut. And right Gotta love that combo. Blood there now from Ethan. Those uppercuts are starting to find home, but Ethan he just seems to get fired forward. up. I cannot believe the action here tonight at Redline Fight Night here at the ABA. We are covering this with Gladrap Channel with the champ himself, Mr. Business Shay Brock. What are your thoughts on that first round? Man, well, if Ethan wasn't catching those um, uppercuts with his chin, it would be a very tough fight to call him. Mean, he's still coming forward. He's still letting his shots go. He's still landing. Um, both boys have an awesome chin. They're taking the shots. Um... Yeah, giving everything behind every shot as well. He's swinging, loading up. Ethan I get not a little bit more, a little, little bit flat-footed coming forward though. Hey, you've got to admit though that one, two, right is absolutely beautiful. It's landing, it is. and you know it keeps hitting at the same time. Sometimes in a fight, you see the science behind it and you read or predict what he's going to do, but he keeps yep. landing. He it. keeps landing it. Ethan's not uh, avoiding right. it, or is, is Cedric so good that he can land it? It looks time? like a combo that he's practiced in the gym, and you know, he's, he's, he's just coming through fruition now. But as a fighter yourself, Shay, when you start getting hit with the same shot over and over, do you change your game plan? Right, yeah, I sense he could be getting a little frustrated, getting caught by a right hook there, right on the temple, but he just shakes it off. 
I think you might be getting a bit frustrated with it or and how do you avoid that right rip though what do you do to avoid that it, it's almost impossible to get out of the way of well with his wide guard you know it's, got, it's going to be hard he, he splits it straight up the middle every time and it's coming straight forward there the head movement would help as well it's like that beard is a pinpoint red mark but it's absorbing dart. the shot. He's, he's, <laughs> it's not even phasing him. He, it seems to just tick him off a little bit and he just comes forward. But it's almost like uh, Ethan's a dartboard and Cedric is throwing the dart every single time at his jaw with Handy that right rip. Just that right hand in general. Oh, Ethan tries to copy the same style. As we're saying, how do you avoid it? Maybe throw the same back. Yeah, that's a good point. One, two, rip, but... Didn't seem to uh, do too much there on the guard. Nice. Oh, this is an absolute left. crazy fight here, Shay. What's Ethan made of? He's just taking these shots like they're nothing and coming straight forward. It's almost like this he loves to, it. Yeah, exactly. He's, he takes a shot, smiles, and comes back. Bit of frustration for him. Oh, on he's the coming face in now. now like an animal. This is a barroom yeah. brawl. See the fire in his eyes now. Look at the look. From but he's Ethan. walking straight into the shot. Oh! Big right, ah, oh, sorry, left there on the chin of Ethan, but he just eats it and comes forward. Oh, grabs the rope for a bit of support. Body Six. shot, uppercut. Nice. This is an absolute washout. I cannot believe what I'm witnessing right here. Look at this in the corner, going for it. Is he just going to want to keep his chin down if he's going to be in the corner like that? They are putting scores on doors. What a round, only round two. What, what a fight. And as we've seen in these previous fights, the red line fighters come out strong in the last round, so it's going to make for an interesting third round. Still, I think Cedric's just, he's found his target. He's landing every time, even on the back foot. But it, it just seems to fire him up. Look, Shay, I am going to have to be carried out in a stretcher after tonight. I'm absolutely exhausted just from commentating on all these crazy, crazy fights tonight. What is in the water tonight? Is it the Tongan support? Is it a full moon? What's going on? There's got to be something. Something's, out. something's in the air tonight, you know? Boxing Central versus Red Line. We've got Cedric and Ethan. Cedric in the blue, the black and white, and Ethan with the beard that just loves to come forward. Nothing hurts him. Look at him, just coming. takes it and yeah. walks forward. Cedric coming out strong, maybe he can sense something. Cedric just throwing Trying bombs. that uppercut again, it didn't seem to land now. I think um, Ethan's caught on to it. Had a nice tight guard this time. He certainly is. Look, he just missed that. Cedric slightly above, slightly uh, one step ahead in every single move that yeah. Ethan throws. And I, I think he nailed it right there. He's one step ahead. Every time uh, Ethan goes looking for the punch, he's not there. Look at him, he's, over, he's overthrowing, he's walking back. You know, he, it's, still, it's still tough, isn't it, Shay, when someone's walking forward towards you and throwing shots. It's not like he's just taking it, he's actually throwing back. Yeah. Takes a nice one on the body there. Cedric is absolutely throwing down. Capitalising on every single shot. But this Ethan character, he's made of something else, man. He's, he just doesn't he just doesn't say no. He might be related to Savan because he just does not go down, keeps walking forward, loves getting oh, hit. Oh beautiful shots there landed by both boys. Cedric right, he's he's found his mark. Boys getting a bit tired, I suspect. This is an absolute oh. barn burner by Cedric! Bites out on his mouth guard and throws Hadouken again. Punch right through the middle. Oh, big shot there from Cedric. Ethan comes back. Why well, he's showing he's got a chin as well as, as great boxing skills, you know. And this is an absolute boys. slugfest. These guys are just going hammer and tong, brawling till they fall. Someone is going to go down or are they going to keep standing up? They look absolutely knackered in there, but they're still throwing. What Boys still going really? right to the final bell. Cedric happy as Larry. 
Even Vasco is exhausted from screaming. And again, showing his respect to his opposition. Ethan, you are an absolute super human being. He's like a universal soldier. He just can't forward. Nothing stopped him. It was like Van Damme versus Dolph Lundgren right there, wasn't it? <laughs> that was oh, I can't believe it. Who are you calling for the winner of that one, Shay? I'm going to have to go with our, our man uh, Cedric on this one. Just landing the cleaner shots. More of them. Um, even on the back foot, you know, he was landing the shots. Uh, even now and then, he would you know, turn off. I'd be surprised to see it go other, other way. Look, I'm just uh, blown away by the action tonight, and I'd have to agree with you there. But something about Ethan, man, I just love seeing him fight. What an absolute warrior. He turned it up Ooh. and didn't stop. He just, he was like an energizer bunny. He's got a great chin on him. And a beard on that chin to add, too. Yeah, look, uh, you're right about that beard. It almost seemed like a target there for Cedric with that, uh, that uppercut. But I think the beard was the difference, wasn't it? Yeah. Just catching, catching all those punches flush on the beard. Maybe the, does the beard absorb it? Is that why you grow up with the beard? Oh, man, I, 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 keep this, I try to keep this as clean as possible. Judge one scores for competition, 30-27, blue corner, Levo Satelli. Judge two scores at 29-28, red corner, Angel. And judge three scores the competition, 29-28, for your winner by split decision, putting it in the blue corner! Cedric Levo Satelli! Well, I said the first fight, the crowd got their money's worth. They'd they're getting their money's worth times 10. What a fight. What Crouch a win. Is getting spoiled tonight here, Isaac. Oh, times 10, you know. It's like buying a dollar scratchy and winning 50,000. These Just guys please. are getting their entertainment tonight. And what a fight that was. Ethan. Hey, he didn't win, but I don't want to see him fight again. Nice. Nice.